In this video, we're going to show you how to fade out audio in both Adobe Premiere Elements and Adobe Premiere Professional. So you could just watch whichever section applies to the version that you have. So for Adobe Premiere Elements, we have this bike video, and we have at the end, we have it fading out here with some music that goes longer than the video track here. So it goes like this. And so we want to be able to fade out the music as well. So obviously you could go and just clip your music to the same spot as the uh, audio or the video, I should say. And then to fade out the music, you have two options. Uh, the first one is to, you could right click and choose the fade and then fade out audio. And it'll put this little uh, dot here and they could kind of stretch it to like, to maybe to like where the, video transition goes and then that way you could fade it out like this actually that video fades a little too long but you get the idea and the other way let's get rid of this is you could go to your transitions then go to audio and apply the constant gain just drag it onto the clip there and you could just kind of pick a time and you could match it, make it match the uh, duration here. And close this up here to get more room. And you could also, if you didn't know, you could, if you zoom in enough, you could drag your uh, transitions on the timeline on the clip as well. So let's see how this one works out here. So you get the idea. So the same thing. So whatever way is easy for you. So either the uh, audio transition for constant gain. Not sure why they call it constant gain when it's fading out. Or you could right click, fade, fade out audio, then just kind of drag the little marker to where it goes. And then for a professional, we got the same clip here. So what you could do obviously is go to your clip here and cut it at the end just to get rid of the extra. And then from here, you want to go to your effects and then audio transitions, not audio effects, the transitions. Then you have the same constant gain here. And you could drag that on there. And then once again, you could stretch it out to, to match. And then we have the same effect here. And then of course you could adjust your uh, fade for both your video and your audio, you know, to kind of match and make it work out a little bit better. So, yeah, seems like uh, Elements has two ways to do it. The Premiere Pro doesn't have the fade option when you right-click on a clip. So it looks like you're stuck with a constant gain um, audio effect. All right, hopefully that helps. Thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.